We all are excited the day before a game, and part of that excitement is getting everything ready. Whether you are a seasoned player or starting out, this day before your game is the day when most screw-ups happen, which results in missing parts of your gear, empty batteries, or general frustration. In this video, we'll go over some tips to make sure you are all set for your next game. Let's start with number 10. Load your mags. Load your airsoft magazines with BBs the day before the game to avoid last-minute hassles. Testing them to ensure they fit properly is also a good idea. If you use gas blowback replicas, also fill up the gas so that you can spot any leaks and you can still fix it before the game day. And don't worry, leaving them loaded over the night will not do any harm. Tip number 9. If you change anything on your gear, put it on and test it before the game. As an example, let's assume you changed your gear by adding a sling strap integrated into your plate carrier. Testing it before the game and evaluating the changes ensure it's comfortable and functional, preventing surprises on the field. The same goes for everything from a pouch placement on your belt to change in clothing. You'd be surprised how many non-functional combinations I found during all these years. Most of them, unfortunately, in the game. Tip number eight, check if you have both of your gloves. Check your gear to confirm that you have both of your gloves and perhaps shoes as well. It happened to me many times that I see one of them in my gear bag and I automatically assume the other one is there as well. Wrong. And it sucks to only have one glove because Airsoft is a fashion show and with one glove you will look funny, incomplete and maybe you'll end up with cuts and scratches on top of that. If you travel in civilian clothes, forgetting one of your combat shoes at home is a complete disaster. Tip number seven. Charge and check your radio. To maintain effective communication with your team, it is vital to charge and check your radio, including the cables and PTT button. Also, check with the rest of your team via messages that you are all using the same frequency to avoid half an hour of radio checks in the safe zone. If you do this, chances are that everyone will have a working radio the next day, which, to be honest, is pretty rare. Tip number six, check the weather and adjust the clothing if necessary. Pay attention to the weather forecast, mainly if you are using gas-powered airsoft guns. Weather conditions will affect their performance and the same can be said about you. Be ready to adjust your clothing if the forecast changes so that you are prepared for the elements. Tip number five, read the rules. The day before your airsoft game, reading and understanding the game rules is crucial because not all players listen carefully to the briefing or simply cannot hear what is being said because there is just too many people chatting around. Familiarizing yourself with the rules ensures that you play fair and safe. As an example, not knowing that there is a medic in the game can cost you and your team valuable time. Or shooting through small cracks while not being allowed can result in unnecessary arguments with others. On top of that, there is always this one guy who throws a tag in even though pyro grenades are not allowed. Don't be this guy. Tip number four, check your gun before. This one seems pretty obvious, but I always see people on the field before the game even starts messing around with their non-working replicas. The day before, take the time to inspect your airsoft gun, check if your barrel is clean for maximum accuracy, plug the battery in and see if it works and if you can shoot at the distance to check the hop up and accuracy also make sure your battery is fully charged if you play in winter it is a good idea to bring a spare one too because in winter batteries don't last as long tip number three check your red dot you have no idea how many times i arrived at the field and my red dot won't turn on simply because i forgot to turn it off after the last game luckily i learned to have a spare batteries in my gear bag as well as in my car at all times. Don't be like me and check your red dot the day before. Tip number two, don't party too hard. Since most airsoft games are on Saturdays or Sundays, it can be tempting to go out for one beer. Well, I'm not saying you cannot go, but try to avoid late night partying the day before. A good night's sleep is important for maintaining focus and physical performance during the game. Rest well and be at your best. Tip number one, mental check. At the end of every game prep, I simply take a minute and I visualize myself wearing all the items I will need during the game and I check if they are in my gear bag. I always start at the bottom with my shoes, trousers, knee pads, belt, sidearm, magazines and so on and I work my way up towards my head with the mouth guard, glasses, 
headset and a helmet. This helped me many times to discover something that was missing and it doesn't take much time at all. Just try it once and see if it helps you. I hope you learned something new. Thank you for watching and see you next time.